that may be a good stopping point. Did you see my bad joke, Pimple? What is cracking, guys? Sheesh, yo, ho, ho, you've done it. Sheesh. <laughs> uh, all right, I'll be right back. I believe it saves when you level up. Well, I think I just leveled up ish. Um, see it in a minute. All right. Uh, Abno fights. Who been here when Big was playing Ruina? Did he unlock any floors? Sort of. Hello, child. What's up? What's up? Why? Hey. Why? Why? What's up? What's up, wheezy, snorty fellow? We've got uh, basically a real life Mr. Midnight here with us. We could do an interview. What's up? Mr. Midnight, how are you doing? Sort of? I mean, I, I beat some floors, some levels, but I, I don't know how much I progressed. I don't think like I didn't I didn't do any abno fights if that's what you mean. I don't think anyone paid attention. We were mostly arguing about consciousness and paintings. We could be uh, we could be heading into the home stretch here, guys. I haven't killed my parents. That monster wants to trick me. I know. Everybody is crazy around here. I have to find Kitty and leave. Oh no, I finished my coffee. You know what that means, guys? Time for coffee number two. <laughs> I 
cat is demanding attention. Who am I to deprive them? Can't be real, Mr. Midnight, because real one is dead. Wow. I don't know if that's true. Maybe they are. What the? This is not a scene you want to walk into. Kitty, my darling, I'm here for you. Are you alright? Kitty, answer me. What's wrong with you? Meow, meow. Why won't you talk to me, Mr. Midnight? Here, let me see if I can get Mr. Midnight to say something. Bean sludge. Why won't you talk to me, Mr. Midnight? Please don't do this to me. Purr. Hey, we have real sound effects. Talk to me, Mr. Midnight. This isn't funny. This is It's this place, isn't it? You must get out of here so you can talk to me again. I'll take you to Etherstam, my darling. Palantras can help us. I promise you nothing will tear us apart again. Meow. Kitty, I'll be right back. I must help Dr. Dream, alright? He seems to be in trouble. Dr. Dearn, are you alright, sir? Sir, please wake up. Dr. Dearn, wake up. Are you alive, sir? What should I do to wake him up? A syringe. It has red fluid inside. What can it be? Oh, I wonder what. wonder what it could be. I'm sure it's happy fun liquids and nothing bad or dire. I drank a liter coffee today I think I may get a stroke don't know though oh the door closed these automatic doors this must be Dr. Deeren's head oh there's a switch oh ho happy switch time uh oh ouch electric shock Dr. Deeren are you alright sir sir wake up I think I'll just leave it there. Can I push these? Buttons don't do anything. I don't need this. Somebody must really be fond of brains and heads. Apply knife to wake people up. All right, try it. Can't be done. Knife on switch. Use syringe. Maybe this will wake up. This is. This game is absolutely deranged. Why? Look at her face. Hold on. Okay. Ah, damn. What was that? Don't worry, Dr. Deeren, it's me, Fran. What? I can't see very well. Fran Bo, sir, from the Oswald Asylum. We were at the cemetery, remember? Fran, what happened? Why am I tied to a chair? What have you done? I'm trying to help you, sir. The big monster brought you here. We must go. She's probably the one who put the doctor in that chair. Come on, Fran. Monsters? I don't feel like playing games. All right, it wasn't a monster at all. Just let me help you. Who's that? Well, what is she doing here? I thought you chained her. Arg. But I did. I told you she was a hard one to tame. Do you want me to get rid of her? Get rid of me? Aunt Grace, what, why are you talking like that? Who is this old man? How lovely. You sound just like your mother when she was young. My mother? Do you know her? Who are you? I'm Dr. Oswald Harrison. I know everything about you, friend. Oswald? From Oswald Asylum? Yes, Fran, the same old man. Why do you know about my mother and my aunt? She probably doesn't even know how to find the vein. <laughs> she probably s stabbed his throat and he just like drank it. Many years ago, I was studying the magnificent complexity of twin siblings. Lucia and Grace were part of my study. Both helped me to find the key to success. 
The key? Hmm, did you know that my mother and father were murdered? <laughs> That's a non sequitur if ever I've heard one. Of course, Remor did a great job. His power of manipulation is extraordinary. What I don't understand is how you can be so calm about it. It was you holding that knife after all. I'm telling you, Franbo has a twin sister. I'm not calm, sir. I knew it was Remor all the time, but why does he hunt me? Remor is the manifestation of your weakness. A blinded and powerful manifestation of your fears. But why would the monster kill my parents? Because your parents were interfering with my work. I actually did you a favor. You are suffering. Pain is connected to growth and strength, Fran. Oswald, please, let's just do what we need to do. Please don't be mad at me. We're family. Let us go. My kitty and I can find a place to go without bothering you. Please just let us go. Yeah, you're right, Fran. I'm sorry for being so hard on you. Come on, let's go now. I love this game. It's the most accurate interpretation of how it feels like when you don't sleep enough. <laughs> Fran, my dear, listen to me. You must know Dr. Oswald only wants the best for you. When Lucia was pregnant with you, he knew you'd be a very special girl. He told us to be, to take good care of you, but your mother betrayed us. She wants to hide, she wanted to hide you from us. She thought we wanted to kill you, but that's not true. Dr. Oswald really wants to give you the best. But for that, you must allow him to try a little experiment on you. And then everything will be fine? Of course, but there is still one thing we must take care of. No! Mimesis, what happened? This little traitor must go. Ah! Oh my god. I told you, if they did anything bad to the cat, I was uninstalling this game. No, kitty. Ah, kitty. That's a man, Chitty Poofs. Come on, Fran, stop weeping. The cat is dead now. But he was my friend. You killed my best friend. You also helped to kill my parents, didn't you? Didn't you? How can you live with yourself? I hate you. I hate you. Stop it, Fran. Help. Help. Please help. Wheels over with the gun. <laughs> you may have knife on your side, Fran. You may have used knife to solve all of life's problems, but I have gun, the ultimate successor. And I will solve this problem right now. <laughs> Apply knife. Don't you dare, Grace, you little monster. You wouldn't want to you you wouldn't want to try to use knife in a gun situation now, would you? Oh my god, actually shot her. Holy crap. What the hell, game? Oh my goodness. She's totally insane. Bring her to me. I'll do the experiment while she is still warm. What the... This game is absolutely crossing every line. <laughs> I need to extract the brain right away. What is happening? Fran, are you alright? What have you done with her? She, she shot her! Tried to kill me. You are right about Fran, Dr. Deer, and she was sick. But she's bleeding. Let me take care of her. No, you won't. She is mine now. I've been waiting for this moment for many years now. You've been waiting for many years to shoot a child? Jesus. This is the worst thing that has happened on this stream. <laughs> By far. <laughs> Looking for the right child, the, the right brain. Now that I have her, nothing can stop me. I don't know, bud. Not so fast, crazy man in a wheelchair wielding a gun. It's a manifestation of Fran's fears and problems. Here to save the day. Fran, everything will be fine. Who are you? I'm Itward, the one many children talk about. 
but you're not human. Ecto bro, ecto prot, palantras manokaist. Gorska, itward, I found him. Oh my goodness, stay away from the girl, leave her alone. No, it's the cat. He's okay, actually. Little friend must be cured. Do you think you can use the same body? Yes, she's not completely gone yet. Here I go. Turn her into a tree. Mother Mabuka, you took the innocence of the child. Fran is now dead and alive. Wake up in darkness, Fran, and you'll be able to walk towards the light. No, 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 no. Walk, walk away from the light. It word is just like with the cat just like watching observing as if it's like a you know a puppet show <laughs> What happened it word Palantras, my heart hurts. Mr. Midnight, how? You're alive, my kitty. I missed you so much. Please tell me something. Fran, we must go now. Go? All right. Doctor, don't ask no questions at all. Look, this is Itward and Palantras. I told you about them, remember? I told you they were real, see? Can you believe me now? What? Okay, Dr. Dearn is having a bad day. I can't hear you. I think he is under the power of Mabuka now. We really must leave now. But can he come with us, please? He has been really nice to me. Yeah, let's take the man with the bleeding eyes. For sure. He really wanted to protect me and help me. We can't bring him with us, I'm sorry. What we can do is to make him believe that all of this was a dream. He will wake up and think none of this really happened. But he won't remember you, Fran. I see. Well, that's okay, I guess, as long as he is safe. It's very kind. You're finally seeing beyond your own desires. You're becoming one with everything. Your parents would be very proud of you. You really think so? Aw, oh, thank you, Palantras. Hug and kiss. Let's send Dr. Dearn home. She turned into wood once. I thought that uh, Palantris was going to cure her... Uh, cure her wound of bullet shot by turning her into wood or something. Marcel Dearn Anuum Eonum Vecma Vecma Yo So she she died for real now? Goodbye, Dr. Dearn. Let's go home go now, Fran. There's so much you must see and learn. That sounds like fun. Let's go, kitty. I have to say if this game is a metaphor for something, I have no idea what. Like, it's transformed so many times. One thing I do know. That between guilt and fear... I choose happiness. Happy ending! This is the happy ending, right? She is connected with more than one reality. Wait, that's it? The end? Someone said she will become one with everything. Ew. I didn't think I was that close to the ending.
Yay! I don't think she ever left the asylum. I was like, can't. Does someone know definitively, like what, what, like where are we? Did she? She was like hallucinating everything, right? And she wandered out into the wilderness, and like somehow got caught and dragged back to the asylum, and then shot, and now she's dead, right? Like that's, is that, is that where we are with this? Hog. I don't think there's any pogs in that bot. Not enough knife solutions. Uh, question. Would chat like me to switch to a horror game for the rest of stream? Um, it, something shorter and then uh, we could save misfortune for after I finish whatever that thing is. You, you, now you want little misfortune that Bot has asked immediately for? I just feel like doing little misfortune right away might, might be a bit too much of exactly the same. New pills made her go crazy and it all ended badly, but along the way she found herself to die in peace. She's now going to be to the plant land to live a different reality. Well, that's a really strange game. Collection on short horror games. Man, Misfortune is even more messed up. Jesus. I thought this was, you know, the ultimate messed up. It's a bunch of achievements that I didn't get here. Burning the rope. Make the guard fall asleep. Find the twins' favorite doll. Lots of things I missed. Find the picture behind the door. The old story. Is there a true ending? Did I... Is there only one ending? Okay, okay. Um, Alright, let's do uh, Spectral Mall. I'm gonna do Spectral Mall and then um, we'll save the Little Misfortune for maybe a next stream or a couple streams from now. Because I have a couple of things I want to do for the third segment and I, I just need to... I need a small break. Uh...